Check out what this cat said about his human brother. He said, I'm obsessed with brother, and I often just stare at him for a really long time. Nikki Vasquez is a full-time pet psychic. I talked to Cruz here, and I asked him if there was anything in his life he didn't like, and he said, mom's boyfriend. But then he said, don't worry, the feelings are mutual. He doesn't like me either. We can all do this. It's not just me. I learned. Just like with anything else, if we're stressed out, we're not going to be on our A-game, right? Just a few years ago, Nikki was not on her A-game, working as a lawyer, but totally miserable. I was at the point where I was doing animal communication part-time, law stuff part-time, and I knew I wasn't going to be able to excel further in the animal communication while still at the law firm. And I, I never would have imagined that a year later I'd be where I'm at today. Now Nikki's got a waiting list thousands of clients long, booked every day with clients asking for readings. I would say probably 60% of the animals are living and 40% are deceased. All she requires is a photo of the pet and a quiet place to do her reading. All types of animals, ranging from dogs and cats to bearded dragons and geckos. Do dogs tend to be more energetic and cats are kind of shady? Or is that me just projecting what I think everything would be like? That is you totally projecting and I'm not calling you out. The cat sounds the same as the horse, as the bunny, as the gecko, as the cow. But they all have different personalities. Nikki says she's been able to help pets with everything from communicating toothaches and qualms with their nicknames to helping heartbroken pet owners navigate through grief. I am doing what I'm meant to do and helping everyone who comes on my path who wants it. You know, like this isn't for everyone and I'm not here to convince anyone of anything, but it's like, it's possible and we can all do it. Nikki says she takes about 10 minutes before each session to get into a meditative state, which is why she couldn't read my dog Archie during our interview. Yeah, I asked, but she did say he's okay with me calling him handsome all the time, which is good because I do it like 97 times a day. So you did say she makes a living off of this, right? Yeah, full time. She charges $350 per hour. So you could say she's profiting off this. <laughs> Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.